All right, today we're back with some more uh, GTA Online, and uh, this time we'll be doing Sightseer because uh, last time we did Headhunter, and we can't really just do it again. That'd be kind of boring. So let me just register as CEO, and yeah, start the VIP work. There it is down there. So I bought a buzzard recently, so um, it'll be much quicker to get around instead of just driving. Where is it? It's right here. I like how it's free when you like buy it from the war stock site, so you don't have to pay like 25,000 every time. So first thing you gotta do before you get the packages is um, do this hacking game. There's three different versions of it, and this is one of the easy ones. You just gotta wait until it goes to sensor and then you click X. There we go, we finally got it. Now it's marked on your minimap where the packages are and all you gotta do is just walk over there and pick it up. There's not like any um, enemies surrounding it or anything. We got like 14 minutes which is like more than enough time. Oh by the way, if you'd like die before you get all three packages, like you instantly lose the mission. So like I don't recommend just going around causing mayhem while you're doing it. Just gotta do it safely and just get to every uh, location. That was not a good idea. Hope the helicopter's okay. No, I don't think the helicopter's okay. Well, that's not how you do it. All right, so I'm back and uh, yeah, we're done with the first package. Got to get to the second one. Oh, this is like the hard, annoying hacking mission. Like, it keeps changing the location of them. There we go. Actually, not that hard, after all. Since the helicopter blew up, I'm not gonna wait until it, like, lets me spawn another one. So I'll just take this instead. You know, this is a pretty nice car. I might get one for myself. But I'm still saving up for some other things, too. Gotta set the waypoint first. Oh, it's not letting me zoom out. Maybe because I'm, like, in this area. It should let me that. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it said by itself. I forgot it did that. See, that was like some professional driving. You should like take some notes that you're watching. You know what? I'm gonna switch to first person for some extreme realism. Uh, rip that guy. See, look, it's like so realistic. It's almost like I'm in the game, am I right? I hope you guys could tell that sarcasm. I'll rip that guy too. Now the cops are like not happy about that. Alright, here we are with like a, a pretty beat up car. Where is this thing? I think it's in the crate. Yep, there it is. Now I gotta do the last hacking thing. I already messed it up. Just gotta take my time on this. I don't really need to rush. We got enough time. I think this spells deadlock. Yeah, it does. Alright, time to hop back in the car and go to the last location. There goes the door. That guy almost died, he's like so lucky. I was hoping I would avoid the cops there, but then they saw me. It's not like they could catch me, I'm pretty good at outrunning them. I'm gonna take a little shortcut here. Was that police station? There's like cops everywhere in that area. See, I already lost them. It's pretty easy. Then again, it was like one star.
It's quite a long drive. It's we got like 1.5 miles left. We're gonna take a little shortcut. You know what? There. I got the cops on me, but it's not like it matters. Like, the last package is just right around the corner. Alright, here we go at the last package. Just gotta climb over this thing. Should be right behind this wall. No, there it is. Alright, that sight's here. I got like... 32,000. No, I only got 24,000. I already had 8,000 to start with. It's much, like, easier and more boring than Headhunter, but, like, at least you don't have to worry about, like, dying or running out of time. So if you like what you saw, let me know in the comments or whatever, and I'll see you guys in the next one.